There's a thrift store near our production office that's full of weird merchandise, and we're always in there seeking new inspiration for tricks. Nobody questions the crazy stuff you find in a place like this, which makes it a perfect backdrop for the show. You like to collect stuff? Some stuff. Yeah? I like uh, antiques. Do you like antiques? I had something that we just got in from the 70s. Are you, are you a hunter at all? There's too many trigger hacks that folks out there that hunt nowadays. Well, let me show you what I have. Hang tight right there. You might be interested in this. Right. So, how you doing, young lady? Pretty good, how are you? Uh, I'm doing all right for an old man. I'm doing all right for That's a young man, good. too. This we just got in. Have you ever seen one of these before? It's a duck. Well, it's like a decoy, yeah. I see you saying here. Yeah. Put it up on there. Yeah, but it's a. It's like a. Well, it's one of the most realistic ones. You got the feet here. Yeah. Put the little foot on there. And when they attach, because it has batteries in it, it looks pretty good. As long as you put the head on here, and you just give them a little shake, I think. And, mm -hmm. Yeah, like this in it. <gasps> it's one of the most realistic decoys. I've never seen anything like that. Yeah. It looks so real. Yeah. They Is don't that make real? them. No, it's a decoy. Is it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Crazy. How does it feel? It's, it feels just like, oh, careful, it'll do everything that a real duck does. It's programmed to do everything that a real duck would do. It scratches like a real one. Yeah, it does a waddle, a scratch. That's amazing. Yeah. Do they do anything else like that? It'll just keep on a cycle like this for about 10 minutes, and then it will just fall over because the batteries die. It takes up a lot of batteries. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I but once you get the head in place. And you, yeah. and you, tap, you, you put your fingers in your head. <laughs> bite your uh, probably. Whenever they feel something on there, he'll move his head to where they feel. See, that looks oh fake. Did you see that? Gosh. That looked fake. Is it a robot? Yeah, it's, well, it's, I mean, it's, it's animatronic. It's animatronic, yeah. It, it works with uh, clock 70s? parts from the 70s, yeah, yeah, yeah. because they That is valuable. It's not real. Yeah. They don't, they oh don't. Oh my god. Wait, can you put it apart? Oh uh, I have a tool in the back I gotta take them apart with, but yeah. Well, yeah. I'll be. Yeah, a lot of people would just buy them for toys for kids, but they stopped making them. They stopped making them? Yeah. Why? Well, because hunters were using them uh -huh. as decoys, uh -huh. and they would put them out, and then other hunters were oh, shooting shoot them em. because they looked oh. so real. And then pe love. there was a choking hazard because people it's were taking them home and cooking them. Cooking this? Yeah, it's because they thought it was real. This is amazing. It looks How good, right? It looks, I mean, it, looks, it acts real. It doesn't, I mean, it doesn't look fake at all. Yep. The movements. Yep. Who won? What company designed it? Carbonaro. Carbonaro? Yeah. Carbonaro. It's American? Oh, Italian, I think. Italian. Yeah. Okay. I tell you, I've never seen I mean, it's awesome. Usually when I tell my team that a trick is too ridiculous to work, my instincts are spot on. In this case, I admit that I was wrong. But I don't like to be wrong, so I ran the trick again to see if the first success was a fluke. They used to make them in the 70s. The head goes on and then you just give it a shake like this and then it's like, it looks really real. Wow. Yeah. It's the best decoy they have. That's interesting. Yeah, because they look so real that people were actually shooting the decoys. Wow, you know? this is amazing. Wow, and a lot of people, wow. it looks really real, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's not real? No, it's a decoy yeah, it duck a decoy. from 1974. Oh, so it looked like a duck. Right. Next thing you know, other bird come close to it. Right. And they boom and shoot whatever. Well, yeah. It's if they're trying to get a deer. Yeah, it's a male duck. I gotta come back and get something yeah. like that. They're the best decoys around, but they just don't make I them anymore. Believe that. Yeah, I know. Wow. Can I buy that? Yeah, you can buy it. Yeah, you gonna get it? It looks so real. Yeah. It looks so real. Yeah. yeah. Okay, here, I'm gonna. Uh, I just can't yeah, let me get the, the tool in the back and I can take them apart. When I don't know how to respond, I just say it's in the back and excuse myself. It's perfect for when they start asking too many questions, or in this case, when they want me to dismantle a live duck on the spot. Uh -huh. It's programmed to move like a duck. Interesting. 